Welcome inside the service arena in downtown Red Deer, Alberta. Game three, North Division final. Series tied up at one. Cole Sears back in between the pipes for Red Deer. And it will be Thomas De La Siega for the Mountain View goals. Teams split the two opening two games in Didsbury. Series will now shift back here to Red Deer for two. And we are underway. Some lineup changes uh, for the Vipers. Declan Johnston finds his way onto that top line as uh, he continues to have a monster playoff. Here's Logan Linnell taken away from him. Evan Ingram shoots. Glove save. Cole Sears. First real good look at the hockey game will go the way of Mountain View. Is in this series. Red Deer has not uh, been too good at starting games. However, uh, last time out for 45 minutes was definitely the better team, and Thomas Delasiega stole the show for the Colts in a 3 1 victory. It was 3 1 with an empty netter. Hard hit by De on Declan Johnston. And now Evan Ingram is knocked off of the puck. It'll come to Cole Sutherland. Sutherland, he gets pasted by Brody Kalinowski. And now Ingram on a turnover. Here's Sutherland, shoots, scores! Early strike for Mountain View on a Red Deer turnover. It's 1 0 Colts. Cole Sutherland from Evan Ingram. As Sutherland just absolutely roofs that one on Sears. Not a very good start here for Red Deer. Is uh, the Vipers go down one nothing early here in this one? As this will come now to Mitch Visser. Visser into the middle. Getty now Leatherdale. Another chance for Mountain View. Bang it away. The rebound cleared by Chopek. Red Deer nearly goes down 2 0 early here in this one. Here's Aiden Wilson. Wilson. He gets around one. He's looking to center this. He hits Kingwell. The trailer. A shot blocked. Now back come the Mountain View Colts. Maybe a breakaway it is. Josh Getty to the net. He shoots. He scores. 2 0 for the Mountain View Colts. And uh, and maybe the lineup changes uh, not paying off so far for Red Deer as uh, Josh Getty strikes for the second time early in this one for the Colts broke away. And 3:02 into this one, the Colts have a pair. It's two nothing. Red Deer also down two nothing in the in the second game of the series in Didsbury. Ended up uh, recovering from that all right, although they lost the game. So here comes Rothenbush. Rothenbush out of click, back to Rothenbush. Save, rebound, it's cleared by the Vipers. Who are just getting run out of their own building here. And now Wilson is Sim. Sim gets pasted in the slot. Spencer down, moves this one up. Keegan Kingwell's got control. Kingwell carries in over the right side. Now to Kale Point. Poked off that one. Thorne back into the lineup tonight. Thorne tied up for our corner. Aiden Wilson. Looking to dish this one off. He goes into the corner. Kale LaPointe. LaPointe now to Lane Sin. Sim looking to get this one to the net. Here's Wilson to Sim. A backhander. Della Siega keeps it out. 5.32 gone in the first period. 2-0 Colts. Another slow start for the Vipers, and this time it's going to cost them dearly. Draw one by Goodall. Back to the line, Marsolier. Now Goodall. No, sorry, that's Scott. Marsolier at the point. Guzarubiak shoots. It's blocked. Wyatt Jelinas has control. Jelinas looking to move this one out. He hits Austin Peterson. Peterson trying to carry right in. Peterson shoots. Glove save Cole Sears. Sears have been beaten twice early here in this one. 6.20 gone in the game. Tristan Zerubiak had this shot blocked. Seven-one, the shots favor the Colts. 
Now right out front, Peterson's getting another one right there in tight. And Sears made the save. Jackson Goodall will come out for Red Deer. Goodall knocked off of the puck and Austin Peterson's got control. Peterson trying to get around angle twit. Couldn't the first time, but he's got it right back. Peterson is at Jacob Andersag. He shoots, blocked, penalty coming up against Red Deer. So the disastrous start will continue for the Vipers. Tristan Zerubiak goes off for tripping. That's a horrible call, but nonetheless, a kill that the Vipers are going to need here. Draw one by Red Deer and cleared. Kale Brown moves to Josh Getty. Getty carries right in, trying to get around Angle Twit. Couldn't, and tries to use the glass, but Angle Twit goes right into his own bed, so a faceoff stays deep in Viper territory. Yates and Lawson, the penalty killers out there right now for the Vipers. Draw one and controlled by the Vipers, trying to get this one out. They did. Not all the way down, though. And hard hit Getty over to the far side. Store. Sutherland's got his second. It's 3-0 Mountain View. And the Red Deer Vipers getting absolutely caved in in the first, last, first 748 of this hockey game. Mountain View has three goals. Second one for the captain, Cole Sutherland. Chips that one on the backhand by Sears. Wonder if maybe Billado is going to come in tonight, right now, just to kind of get, it's still early. Rendier's down three, but certainly not over. With there being, you know, more than two and a half periods left. Maybe just a shake-up. No, Billado will stay on the bench. Sears stays in the net for now. 12-12 to go in the period, the first period. And 3-0, the Colts lead. Here's Bailey Lawson. Lawson shoots from ways out, and good stop there. By Della Siega. Next one, you figure it's got to go to Red Deer here if you're going to stay in this hockey game. Face off one by the Vipers. Kingwell back to the line. Chopek. Now it's going to be for Lawson. Lawson turns this one over, and here come the Mountain View Colts. Evan Ingram's got a break. Ingram right in. Ingram shoots. Blocker saved by Sears. Red Deer been just brutal on in transition tonight, reminding me of Game Six against the Thrashers. All kinds of turnovers and just cannot. Get any sort of uh, flow going here. Now here's Linnell. The Johnston shoots. Stopped by Della Siega. And he's going to hold on. 10-11 to go. Still 3-0 Mountain View. Face off left side of Della Siega. Yates out there. LaPointe and Sim. Back to the line. Angle to it now to Yates. Yates spins and fires. Lane Sim in behind the goal. Trying to dig this one loose as Caleb LaPointe. Sim to Yates. Great shot and a better save by Thomas Della Siega. Now Yates out of the corner. Far side. LaPointe shoots. Scores. Red Deer needed that one. No, it's a two goal deficit. Half a period to go still or just about. And Caleb LaPointe. It's a big one for Red Deer. It's 3-1. Third line strikes there. Sim kicks to Yates. Yates goes to kill the point. And as I was saying, that was one Red Deer absolutely had to have. But now you're only down two. And uh, it's plenty of time to go. To get this thing back even late. Sim tees this one up. This one goes way high and wide and all the way back down the ice into the Red Deer zone. Brody Kalinowski will start out for the Vipers. Over to Lane Sim. Sim carries in on the left wing. 
Sim back to the point. One timer. Teed up. Goes wide. There's the point right in front. This line causing some distress for the Mountain View Colts. Out there is here Spencer Yates into the middle. Kale LaPointe. LaPointe, Kalinowski, shoots save, rebound. Scott scores! Red Deer's right back in and it's 3-2! Nick Scott inserted into the lineup and he's on the score sheet. Vipers a shot away from tying this thing back up. Is Red Deer a refusal to go away here? Seven forty-four to go in the first period, and we've seen five goals scored in the hockey game already. Here's Ryan Clake trying to get over the line. Vanderzeg one timer. Oh, that one nearly leaked in past Sears, but a good job by Brent Marsolier to take that one out of the goal mouth. Now here's Austin Thor. Thor taken away from him at center ice by Clink. Clink down to his brother Ryan. Shoots, gloves, saves Sears, and he will hold on. So Red Deer coughs up three, then they promptly score two. So this game, hockey game again, folks. 6.47 to go in the first period. Brown over to the near side, neatly intercepted by Tristan Zerubiak. Doesn't have the speed to pull away. So he'll come in here on the right wing. Zerubiak trying to drive it wide. Zerubiak in behind the goal, trying to center that. He's got it back. Zerubiak from distance, shot tipped. Oh, this one goes just wide. Scott out there in behind the goal. Nick Scott knocked off of the puck. There's Brown getting it up to Peyton Rothenbush. Rothenbush now to Clink, Clink now Ingram. Ingram stolen off of him. There's Marsolier to Aiden Wilson. Wilson driving it wide on the left wing into the middle. Zerubiak, a chance, comes to Della Siega. And he's going to cover it up despite no real danger there, but he will hold on. 4.52 to go here in the first period. All kinds of action. Here in period number two, uh, period number one, game number three. Red Deer will win that draw. Here's Angle to a different shot from a ways out. Gloved and kept alive by Della Siega. Ingram now to Cole Sutherland. Sutherland trying to get around Kalinowski. Still with it. Houchin from the line. Shoots this one. I think that hit something in front and went wide. Good job by Anderson. Right out front. One timer couldn't connect for Gallon. Shoots. Save the rebound. Gathered by Dalton Angle to it. This line has just been too much to handle for the Vipers tonight. But Angle Twit will carry it out. Angle Twit cannot get it around to changing Mountain View defense. But now it's going to come to Hoppus. Hoppus shoots from the slot. Good stop by Della Siega. Difference right there, so he's forced to hang on. 3 2. Mountain View leads. 3 0 3 to go in this first period. Draw to the left side of the Colt goal. One by Mountain View, and here's Mitch Visser. Visser trying to split the defense. Kingwell, though, stays right with him. Visser carries to the middle. He shoots. Good save. Cole Sears. He's going to hang on with 2.29 to go in the first period. Top line out there now for Red Deer Lawson, Liddell, and Declan Johnston. Draw one by the Colts over to the far side. Leatherdale now down, a backhander's blocked. Logan Linnell will start out. Linnell is knocked off of the puck. Here come the Mountain View Colts right in. Here's a chance for Josh Getty. Getty, oh, couldn't center it. Getty's got it back. Taken off the puck, Bailey Lawson's got control. Over to the far side, Logan Linnell. 90 seconds to go in the first period. Linnell, he's trying to get a shot away, couldn't. Puck back to the line, Reagan Kime on it for the Colts. Here's Lane Rothenbush, and Rothenbush might have a breakaway or at least a two-on-one. Getty to Rothenbush, scores! Turnover at the blue line for Red Deer again is buried on him, and Lane Rothenbush 
It gives the Colts back their multiple goal lead. It's 4-2. Too careless tonight are the Red Deer Vipers with the puck. And this team, this Mountain View Colts team is uh, awfully good. And I'll tell you, if you're going to be careless with the puck, they're good at bury you, and they have the Red Deer Vipers thus far. This is the most frustrating thing for Red Deer in game six. Every time they seem to get back into the hockey game, the, in game six of the last series, they just seem to give another one right back. Here's Kale Point. nifty move, a one-timer looking in front for Sammy Fand on it. And now Reagan Kimes steps around Marsolie. Can't get around him though. Reagan Kimes still got it. Kimes to the net. Block the point to Sim. And this period's done. JD Morical is going to be livid with this period for the Red Deer Vipers. First home game of the North Division Final. And they're getting absolutely caved in by the Mountain View Colts. Mountain View, a 4 2 lead going to the lockers. And if they got what they deserved, it'd probably be 5 or 6 2. So Red Deer not out of this thing yet, but this uh, late dagger for Mountain View, that's uh, that's going to be a tough one to recover from. 4-2, Colts after 20. So Red Deer doesn't get outshot that badly, 14-12. to But uh, they did play badly. The puck management was, frankly, just non-existent. And the draw won by the Vipers. Some kicked up the front near boards, and Bailey Lawson will attack here on the left wing. Lawson into the middle. He couldn't get it over to Declan Johnston. Anderson takes it away. Here comes Cole Sutherland. Sutherland right in, tees it up, but it's blocked and taken away by Kalinowski. And now Johnston in on the right side. He gets pasted. Logan Linnell has got it. Linnell stolen from him by Vanderzag. Vanderzeg trying to get around Kalinowski. He cannot do so. Linnell taking away Vanderzeg. Backhander blocked and Lawson will skate it out for the Red Deer Vipers. Left side, Bailey Lawson. Lawson looking to center. Back to the line, Kalinowski. There's Angle to it now, Lawson. Kalinowski into the corner, Declan Johnston. Johnston can't get this one to the line. It's set the length of the ice. Uh, no ice, and I thought that was cleared by a Colt, but I guess not. Maybe it hit a Viper on the way down. I didn't see. Here's now Mac Difference into the middle. Logan Linnell. Linnell looking to center this one. In behind the goal, it's Bailey Lawson trying to get that one out front. And Jack Vergallen will intercept, carry it in. Good play there, though, defensively by Keegan Kingwell. Kingwell tied up by Vissel. And see, this is the kind of thing... <laughs> No, only one Red Deer Viper on the defensive side of the puck on a 50-50 battle. It didn't bite him there, but that's the kind of thing that's just been haunting the Red Deer Vipers tonight. Damian Chopek moves to Mac Difference, and now Wilson lost it, but Difference will come right back in. Difference, a two-on-one maybe here. Here's Hoppus. Denied! Great save by Della Siega. Ryan Plank, he'll come in two on one now for the Colts. Plank save, rebound, Rothenbush. Can't pull the trigger, LaPointe takes it away. This third line, new third line, LaPointe, Sim, and Yates. They've been real good tonight. Maybe they're going to get scored on here. Yes, they will. Ryan Plank at the top of the slot, one times one home. It's 5-2 Mountain View. As the Mountain View Colts continue to pour it on here tonight. And uh, it's again the carelessness with the puck down low, a turnover. And the Colts are saying, you want to keep turning the puck over, we'll do it. We'll play this way all night, fellas. Yes, here's Kale LaPointe carrying it in over to the far side. Lane Sim couldn't get it. Intercepted there by Rothenbush. And now here's Clink. Clink kind of get it away from uh, Marsolier. Marsolier tied up to our side. Austin Thorne. Thorne moves to Spencer Yates. Yates carrying it wide on the right side. This one goes in deep. Spencer Dow. Dow now to Regan and Kai. Kai stolen there at the line. And now this one will be still at the line. 
This one goes in deep, a hard hit! Tristan Zerubiak absolutely pasted his man. Down now to Kai. Poked off the stick, Jackson Goodall's got control for Red Deal. Tristan Zerubiak to Scott. Scott looking to move this one up ice. Scott into the middle of Zerubiak. Zerubiak cannot pull the trigger. Goodall spins and fires. Dallas Iaga makes the save. 11.44 to go, second period by two. Mountain View leads. Red Deer down by three. And in another situation where the next one's got to be your role. With just over half a hockey game to play. Draw is going to be won by the Vipers. Here's Scott. Scott trying to pull the trigger. Cannot do so. Here's Tristan Zerubiak right in the slot. He shoots it just wide. Jacob Vanderzen tied up far side. A hard hit there. And now Zerubiak's got it neutral zone. Zerubiak moves this one to, tight to Nick Scott. Poked off the puck. Angle to it comes in offside for Red Deer. Face off is going to be just outside the Mountain View Court line. Vander Zag over to the far side. Mitch Visser. Visser into the middle. Getty he shoots. It's blocked. Difference has control for the Vipers, but now take it away again. Here's Leatherdale. Turned over at the, got it uh, back to the line, but it was turned over to Brett Hoppus. And Hoppus will come out over the line, right wing. Hoppus into the corner. Mac difference. Difference to Hoppus. One timer. Great save by Della Siega. Hoppus shoots it. Stop again. Della Siega kicks that out with the stick into the corner. Here's Kale Brown. Brown knocked off of the puck. Brown now right in two on one. Brown shoots it. Blocker save. Goal Sears. Leatherdale in the corner trying to get this one out front. Can't. Damian Chopak LaPointe now over to Brett Hoppus. Hoppus, two on one for Red Deer. Hoppus near side. Wilson didn't get a great defensive play by Jake for Gallon. Jack for Gallon, excuse me. Here comes Evan Ingram. Ingram knocked off of the puck. Ingram now a chance right out front. Jam it away. Sears makes the save. 7.40 to go, second period. Red Deer, at the very least, I would say, needs to at least cut this deficit by one before the end of the period. Here's Sutherland back to the line. Teed up. Houchin tonight. Spencer Yates puts this one up the far side to kill LaPointe. LaPointe now to lane Sin. Sam driving it wide for the Red Deer Vipers. Sam tees this one up from the high slot. And a good stop made there by Della Siega. He will hold on. Face off left side of Thomas Della Siega. Won by the Vipers. Marcel Yates in. In front to Spencer Yates. He's put it high and wide. There's Kale LaPointe tying his man up far corner. LaPointe out in front of the net. Trying to get this one on goal. Cannot do so. Alan Clink. Clink moves this one over to his brother Ryan. Hard hit. Thorn trying to race over to keep it in. He cannot do so. Thorn replaces Connor Sullivan, his usual defense partner, in the lineup tonight. As the coaching staff has been impressed through the three games played by Brett Marsolier. However, I don't think they're impressed with any guy in black tonight. Vipers down 5 2, 6 to go here in the second period. This is game three, North Final Series tied up in one. Braley Lawson. Look at a cut in. Lawson shoots this one. It goes high and wide. Hard hit on the near side boards. Now Marsolier, far side, Jekyll and Johnston. Bailey Lawson right in. He shoots save. Rebound covered up. Thomas Della Siega. Had to make a couple of stops here is Della Siega. Red Deer offensively has not been that bad, to tell you the truth. They're getting their opportunities. It has been defensively in the puck management. There's absolutely caved the Vipers in tonight. As here is Logan B Kale Brown, excuse me, taken off of the puck, and Austin Peterson moves that one up to Wyatt Jelinas. He takes a hard hit. Austin Peterson looking to center that one in front. Jelinas takes a bump. 
And now Bailey Lawson moves this one to Declan Johnston. Johnston will start out. Johnston looking to drive it wide. Johnston hits Dalton Angle to it. Now Scott shoots. Great save, Dallas Iaga. And this is what I'm talking about. Randy has created some, some chances offensively. And they've been stymied by Dallas Iaga as they were in game two. But in game two, defensively, they were pretty good. I mean, they only gave up two goals for the goaltender in that. They gave up an empty netter as well, but, I mean, that's going to happen. But uh, tonight, it's just a completely different story as the Mountain View Colts have really taken it to the Red Deer Vipers and made them pay for the mistakes. Here's Mitch Visser. Now maybe another opportunity for Mountain View. Centering pass. Dalton Angle takes that away. Three minutes to go here in the second period. Angle to it, right in over the line. Stops up, looking for an option. It goes in behind the net, Tristan Zerubiak. Zerubiak to Nick Scott. Scott spins away from the check to Zerubiak in the corner. Centering pass scores! Jackson Goodall! And another fourth line strike for Red Deer. It's back to a two goal game. 5-3. Great pass out front by Zerubiak, and Goodall makes no mistake. And that's what I said. I said Red Deer needed to at least get it to a two-goal deficit before the end of the third. And right now, they've done. Of course, we've seen Red Deer score these goals. think it's going to give them some momentum in the uh, next possession, give up one. But two and a half to go in the second. And the Vipers strike again. Every goal coming from the bottom six. Here's Cole Sutherland. Knocked off of the puck, tied up near side boards. Colts able to carry it in, though. Here's Sutherland. Here's Anderson back to the line. Rothenbush. Sutherland in the corner. Now a hard uh, play there by Difference, and Difference uh, will take a penalty here as he will go off for tripping. So Red Deer to the penalty kill. They're 0 for 1 tonight. As you hope the PK woes don't come back for the Vipers that dogged them in round 1, in round 2, excuse me. Need a big kill here with a minute 30 to go in the second period. Down over to the near side. Vander Zang, he shoots this one. Save, rebound. Sutherland nearly had the hat trick. This one cleared the length of the ice by Lane Sin. Approaching the final minute here of the second period. Red Deer just wants to... Get this one back to the lockers. It's a two-goal deficit. Yes, here is Kingwell. Good play there. Now Anderson, though, takes it away. Kalinowski, though, able to win a loose puck battle there and clear the length of the ice. Spencer Dowd moves to Colton Anderson. Anderson, good play on him by Kalinowski. Turned back. Dowd knocked off of it. Colton Anderson's got it here for the Colts. Anderson and Sim in the battle. Anderson comes out. Now there's Spencer Dowd to Colton Anderson. Anderson, a backhander, glove save Sears. Holds on with 8.9 seconds to go in the second period. Mountain View 5, Red Deer 3. 35 seconds remain on the Colt power play. And if Red Deer can get out of the period, have about uh, 27 seconds worth carry over into the third period. Draw one by Red Deer. Angle Twit will not be able to clear. And now here's Ingram over to the far side. Plank. Now Vissa right in front. Rothenbush. Save. Rebound. Rothenbush still there. But this period will come to a close. Sears able to keep that one out. Massive job to do that. Is this game now not over? Just a two-goal deficit for Red Deer going to the third. Five-three Colts after 40. Red Deer now shoots Mountain View in that period. But they still give up a couple of goals. Difference into the box here. It was Red Deer still got to kill 26 seconds of Mountain View power play time. Good off. He's knocked off of the puck. So come over to Getty. Getty chased by Sim. Anderson, okay, he gets around his man there. One timer, Sutherland. He's got the hat trick scores. 
Cole Sutherland, third of the game. Colton Anderson and Josh Getty in Red Deer. Gives up another power play goal tonight. And it's just an absolute flashback to that series. With the Thrashers at this point, where the power penalty kill cannot buy a kill. And... Red Deer in game six, poor puck management. They're playing better offensively than they did in that game, but now 6-3, Mountain View. Here's Dalton Angle to it. They're gonna move this one up to Johnston, he does. Bailey Lawson, trying to get this one in deep. He hits Jacob Vanderzag instead. Vanderzag over to Cale Brown. Brown will start out for Mountain View. Brown, looking to hit his man, instead he shoots it. He's gonna go high and wide. Logan Linnell at the line. Good body check there by Declan Johnston. Linnell still has control, and Linnell will start out with it. Linnell hits Difference, who's off the bench. Mac Difference. Back up top, Linnell shoots. Good glove save. Delasiega will hold on. We see top 10 in penalty minutes. Getty leads the way. Kalinowski right there with him, though. Mr. Getty Leatherdale out there for the Colts. Hoppus, Wilson, Linnell. Hoppus, Wilson, Difference, excuse me, for the Red Deer Vipers. Here's Damian Chopak right from the point. Shoots it, low blocker. Good stop, though, by Della Siega. He holds on. It's Red Deer's top six. Silent tonight. All three goals coming from the bottom six. Kale LaPointe, he has one. And then the fourth line's got two. Goodall and um, Scott, each with one. Draw one by the Colts, and Corbin Hauschen will start out the other way. Hauschen knocked off of the puck. Here's Jamie and Chopek. Moves to Aiden Wilson. Wilson will start out. Mac Difference. Difference now in. Difference shoots it. Trying to go high glove. Aiden Wilson back to the line. Keegan Kingwell. Kingwell now to Difference. Brett Hoppus. He shot it. It got blocked. Hard hit in the corner. Wilson trying to move this out front. Eden Wilson now to Hoppus. Hoppus, a difference, a backhander. Rebound, shoveled home, Brett Hoppus. And it's again a two goal game. 6 4 is the score. We'll see what kind of response this gets from the Red Deer Vipers. There's a rebound right to Hoppus. He shovels it home on the backhand. Sixteen to play, so two goal deficit. Certainly, uh, plenty of time. Still sixteen minutes to go. Here's Peyton Rothenbush, a one timer. In front, Rothenbush again, back to the line. This is Alan Clink. Clink, back up top. And now here's Rothenbush over to Ryan Clink. Corbin Hauscher. Hauscher now to Rothenbush. Ryan Clink shoots. Glove save, full series. You will hold on to that. Six four Mountain View leads. 15 minutes thereabouts to, that, to go here in the third period. Draw one by the Vipers. Here's Kale LaPointe. LaPointe will try to get this one over center, and he'll put it in deep. Gather their doubt. He got tasted. Yates trying to go up front. Still, he got that eye. Kick save made by Della Siega. Real good look there for Lane Sim. Shooting this one from distance. Sears makes the save on Rothenbush. Great stop in tight on Sim by Thomas Della Siega. Nearly got the Vipers to a one goal deficit. Draw one by the Colts. Dow centers this over. It's taken away by Tristan Zerubiak. Zerubiak knocked off of the puck and Austin Thorne got it back up to Tristan Zerubiak. Zerubiak back to the line. Marsolier tees this up. Dallas Siega makes the save. 13.21 to go. Scott Goodall's Rubiak. Two goals for that fourth line tonight. They're out there now. Draw one back to the line. Marsolier. Now Scott. 
Marsoli again. Here's the Rubiak. Scott trying to get a shot away. Can't. Reagan Dime will take this out. Trying to get around Thornton. He puts it right to Peterson. Two on one. Peterson. Jalinas. He's denied by Cole Sears. Red Deer gets back to even in this one. Mark that save. Here's Tristan Zerubiak. Trying to get this one around Vanderzag. He cannot do so. Here is Cale Brown. Tied up in the corner. Now it's going to be Peterson. Over to Colton Anderson. Anderson over to Wyatt Jalinas now on the near side. Jalinas trying to get around Austin Thorne. He hits Peterson. A backhander. Anderson goes just wide. Thorne. Doug Lease in the corner. He's got it now. Austin Thorne. Thorne will come in over the red line. Now over the line left side. In the middle here. Scott. A shot. Good save by Dallas Siega. 10.51 to go here. Third period. Mountain View 6. Red Deer 4. Red Deer still in this one. Two goals in half a period is, is a tallish order, but certainly not impossible. As here comes Corbin Hausham moving it over to Colton Anderson. Anderson knocked off of the puck, but Ingram comes right in. Hard hit at the line there, and now it's Logan Linnell will come out for the Red Deer Vipers. Linnell steps around one. Linnell to Wilson, to Lawson. His shot got blocked. Logan Linnell back up top to Declan Johnston. Spins away from a couple of checks. Here's Bailey Lawson. Lawson to Linnell. Linnell now Lawson. Lawson to the line. Dalton Angle Twit. Angle Twit at the line. Puts this one into the corner. Thought they saw a slash there on Linnell. Apparently not. No call coming. Corbin Hauschen with it here. Spin away from the check and come out with it. Here's Zane Leatherdale. A two on one for Mountain View. Leatherdale shoots. Glove save. Cole Sears. Eight and a half to go in the third period. Is uh, Red Deer just this top six? The new look top six has not looked great tonight. 8.33 to go here, third period. Draw one by the Colts. A drive from the line. Rebound right out front. Leatherdale couldn't pull the trigger. And now there's Brett Hoppus. Hoppus to Aiden Wilson. Wilson trying to get it in. Hoppus. Now to Mac Difference. Difference. He gets run over. Couldn't get the pass across. Mac Difference now to Hoppus. Hoppus shoots in tight. Great save by Della Siega. Here's Zane Leatherdale. Seven and a half to go here in the third period. Rims it around to the far side. Here's Rothenbush. Rothenbush. Skates it out himself. Drops off to Dowd. Leatherdale, another two-on-one for Mountain View, and they score. Mitch Visser, 7-4 Colts. Mitch Visser uh, will plant the dagger tonight in the Red Deer Vipers. So, seven minutes to go, three goal deficit again for Red Deer. A really, really not good night. There's here's Vanderzag right in now. Clink shoots, save rebound. There is Lane Sim now trying to get this one out. Vanderzag now to Clink. Clink taking away Chopek. Now it's going to be intercepted by Ryan Clink. No, Alan Clink, excuse me. Taken away, though, in the corner again by Damian Chopek. Here's Lane Sim. Sim stolen from him, but he got it right back over to Spencer Yates. Yates dropped off Kingwell. Kingwell puts it in deep. Cam LaPointe tied up. 5.20 to go here in the third period. Red Deer likely just uh, hoping this thing will come to an end mercifully and get, focus the attention on game four. That uh, becomes a critical game now. Red Deer loses that one. They're down three games to one going back to Dinsbury. Here's Lane Sim shoots. Good save made by Thomas Della Siega. Now Ryan Clink knocked off of it. Lane Sims got it in the neutral zone. Sim tied up there by Peyton Rothenbush. Lane Sim again now works this one out through center. Sim gains the line right wing. Knocked off of the puck. Rothenbush over to the far side. Corbin Hauschen. 
Three and a half minutes to go in the third period. Here's Anderson, far side scores. 8-4 for the Mountain View Colts, Evan Ingram. And the abysmal night continues here in Red Deer. With Red Deer now doubled up here by the Colts, three and a quarter to play. Now here comes Evan Ingram. A little line far side. Cole Sears, I'm a bit surprised, has been left in there for the duration of this onslaught. Is uh, the percentage of blame I would assign to Cole Sears tonight uh, somewhere in that zero region? Um, the Red Deer Vipers have been absolutely horrific. Uh, I would say they've been better offensively than they were in game six against Three Hills, which was pretty bad, but I would say almost worse on the puck management side of things as here come the Vipers in again as a 90 seconds sub 90 to go here in the third period and mercifully so set in deep by the Mountain View Colts and here's Brett Marsolier Marsolier starting to come out with it he's tied up there by Austin Peterson and the whistle goes here so Red Deer will get a power play in garbage time And uh, we'll see what happens here, I guess. As now we get to answer the thrilling question is uh, the, will it be 8 4 or 8 5 the five? Or will Mountain get a shorty and end up 9 5? Draw one by the Colts. Rothenbush sends the length of the ice. As the final minute cannot go by quickly enough here. If you're a Red Deer Viper, Brett Hoppus knocked off of the puck. Angle trip moves now to Kalinowski. There's Keegan, there's Aiden Wilson bumped off of it. Now up top, here's Logan Linnell. Linnell now to Kalinowski. Hoppus to the line, Dalton Angle twit. Linnell and then Kalinowski trade shot. Tip stopped by Delasiega. He'll freeze that. 131 to go in the third uh, in the Red Deer power play. 24.8 in this hockey game. Draw one by the Vipers, Kalinowski shoots. And now a chance again for Red Deer. Wilson trying to bank that one in. He'll come to De Siega. He will freeze that with a minute, tw with a, sorry, minute 20 in the power play. It doesn't matter, 13.1 to go in the third period. So Mountain View gonna take a two games to one lead in the series. And, uh, now, Wednesday night, pretty well a must win for Red Deer. This one cleared down the length of the ice here by the Colts, and this thing's done. An absolutely abysmal hockey game for the Red Deer Vipers. They get crushed 8-4 on home ice. And the Colts take a two games to one lead. The good news is, could have been 2 1, 8 4, or 20 to 1. And uh, it doesn't matter. You can only win one game at a time in a best of seven series. And the Red Deer Vipers uh, have only lost one game today, despite the score. So 2 to 1, a chance for Red Deer to turn it into a best of three uh, on Wednesday night. But uh, that will not uh, console many uh, in the Viper locker room uh, tonight as they will go down two games to one. And they lost pretty heavy at home. Three stars. Colton Anderson is your third star with three assists during the game. Red Deer despite getting caved in the boat shot. Mountain Dew 33 to 29. Josh Getty. Three goals, one, uh, three assists for him in the hockey game as well. So he is your second star and your first star tonight. And we call Sutherland the hat trick in the 8-4 drubbing of the Red Deer Vipers. 
he is your first star tonight. Let's take a look at your uh, highlights and I uh, hope you got some time because there were 12 goals in the hockey game and the vast majority of them did not belong to Red Deer. We got off and run early. Cole Sutherland, just a minute 45 in, beats Cole Sears high glove. One nothing for the Mountain View Colts on that one. And then, not even two minutes later, Josh Getty on a breakaway makes it two nothing for the Mountain View Colts. And the visitors off to a hot start. Cole Sutherland on a power play. Before the halfway mark of the first period, 3-0 for the Mountain View Colts. Red Deer, though, looked like, hey, maybe they're going to make this a game. Nine and a half minutes to go in the first. Kale LaPointe gets the Vipers on the board. And then, not even two minutes after that, Nick Scott would pot one for Red Deer. And it's 3-2. And you know what? Okay, if we can settle down here. Settle in for the long haul. This is going to be a hockey game. That never happened. Red Deer gave up one on another egregious turnover and a horrible D-zone coverage. Uh, gives up a two-on-one. Lane Rothenbush, the defenseman, jumps up into the play and buries that one. It's 4-2 Colts. And then five and a half into the second period, Ryan Clink gets his first of the game, and it's 5-2 for the Mountain View Colts. Red Deer would get back to within two again, though, late in the second period. Jackson Goodall maybe gives the Red Deer Vipers a little bit of life. Red Deer does take a penalty with a minute and a half to go in the period and thinking, okay, well, if you can kill this penalty, get it to the third, you only got to kill like 20 seconds or so. Yeah, it should be manageable. Well, they kill the penalty to end the second period, but within that first 25 seconds and change, guess what? Cole Sutherland completes the hat trick on another power play goal. It is now 6-3 for the Mountain View Colts. 16 minutes to play. Red Deer looks like maybe they're uh, not done yet. Just one final time as Brett Hoppus shovels this one by Della Siega. And it's 6-4. But then with just under seven to play, Mitch Visser on another Mountain View two-on-one plants the dagger through the heart of the Red Deer Vipers. And it's 7-4 Mountain View. And then with three and a quarter to play, uh, just to put a little bit of salt in the wound, Evan Ingram makes it 8-4. That is the final as uh, Red Deer was uh, just horrible managing the puck tonight. It's going to have to improve uh, Wednesday or they're going to be on the break. Quite simple. Thanks for tuning in. We'll be back on the air Tuesday. That's here tomorrow. Tuesday game, 7 o'clock. As uh, the... That's game three of the South Division Final. The Bisons have a two games to nothing lead on Madison Hat. That game will be from Okotoks at seven. We'll see you then.